Hello everybody, welcome to this new video. This is my computer and today you're looking at my computer because I'm gonna be doing a digital makeover um, sort of like I did with the old pastel painting I mean if you can call it a painting um, of the little ships in the fields so I have here on Photoshop I'm using Photoshop because I used to use Medibank paint but I don't know why it's just not detecting pressure anymore and it's kind of it has a weird delay um, from when I put pressure on the tablet and uh, when it shows on the screen so I switched to Photoshop usually my boyfriend uses Photoshop for me it's always been a bit um, I don't know overwhelming um, because I think it's super serious but this is the old drawing I'm gonna remake um, maybe adjust today uh, as you can see it doesn't really have a lot of dimension the liner got completely lost um, it's a traditional piece I did with gouache and I think that it was cute it's just not well executed so what I did first of all I tried to redo the girl um, so I crop her and make her a bit bigger because I can always resize things later but I want to be able to see uh, all the details and you know work adding as much details as I want um, and it's digital art so I can zoom in make things bigger and then resize them and that's super convenient um, so I redid her and there she is I fixed the legs they're still not looking super nice but I think they're just better than they used to be um, this foot was looking a bit weird uh, I had it in the face now the lines are a bit darker hopefully they won't get lost again I don't think so because I'm not really applying anything on top and yes I also change a bit of this arm and the hands because I mean look at them they're so little in real life so they just look like tiny sticks and yeah it's bad <laughs> um, I decided to change the fish because as I said they weren't really doing anything to me Oops, sorry Discord. Uh, I was saying I changed the fishes because oh my god guys shut up okay. I changed the fishes because they weren't really doing it for me they looked kind of weird um, and I don't know I was in the mood for drawing um, I guess a whale like a beluga whale and a killer whale because I think they're super cute and I still have to adjust them as you can see I'm using the front layer I did those two in with the mouse um, yeah just because I didn't want to plug in my tape my tablet and I still had to go to dinner but yeah I did this two little this adjustment and this I guess sketch of the killer whale with the mouse and now I have my tablet plugin I'm using a very old Wacom bamboo and yes I'm gonna work on these guys uh, adjust the size of this one but that's something that I will have to do later because I also want to um, yeah scale everything down and just adjust the composition in the original drawing I had this part with all the sand and water allergies and all that but I don't know if I want to keep that in I really like um, like a full only water for the background the full um, oceanic background I don't know how to say it but, um, but maybe I'll change my mind if it looks a bit too blank um, we shall see I'm gonna work on these guys now so I probably speed up this part of the video 
hope you enjoy grab a cup of coffee tea or just water and yes enjoy the video and i'll pop in later i guess where is the where it is I love belugas, I think they're so cute and funny, um, but yeah, this little guy didn't come up super well and he's looking rough. reference for killer whales and I found out that they don't have fins so low on their body so I fixed them and put them in the right place um, so yeah sorry killer whale
So here I tried and sketched down um, a background and as I said before I just wanted um, a very painterly full ocean uh, background so uh, without any like sands or something like that. So I decided to play around with some shades of blues and green because lately I've been really enjoying it and it was looking a bit plain to me so I added some bubbles um, and yes I just really love the texture of those brushes. I really like to add um, different types of texture especially from the digital art and I usually go for brushes that looks like chalk or crayons. Um, I think they add such a nice finish to the old piece and they look very metallic and I really really love that. Um, so yeah, I also picked out some colors for um, the main character. Just wanted to see if they went well with the background. And actually, I got inspired for this very small color palette, like the um, minty pastel green and the blue, this very light coral and the orange. Um, I got inspired for those four colors um, from my previous job. <laughs> um, so I used to work in an animal um, shop. Uh, we, we were selling um, tissues but also products for animals and there were a lot of toys. And we had the small little both for kitties um, and they were all pastely and they had those four colors. And they were super cute because they looked like uh, mini rugby balls but they were like, I don't know, 3 centimeters, so super tiny and they were these pastel colors and I was like, oh my god, they look so good together um, I should use them um, eventually so here I am and I think they look so nice they are just so cute um, and of course with the other two very cute animals um, even though one is incredibly dangerous but it's just like it was, they look cute and then they will actually rule the world eventually and probably kill everybody but yeah that's not the point <laughs> so I think they just look super cute and um, yeah I did the background of camera uh, because I was just just practically laying down some brushes and see how it all looked and it wasn't a great process uh, there wasn't much thinking behind it, so that's how it looked and of course I'm going to refine it and yeah, I use a very painterly look for the main character and the beluga and the killer whale and I really like how it turned out. Um, I tried to uh, select some color from the background and use them for uh, coloring the main character and the, um, some accent on the two animals because um, I thought it would look more cohesive and yes I really really like it.